For a YouTube channel to be successful, it's best to stick to the same tried video format and keep reusing it over and over again, or so they say. Well, on this channel, I'm going to do the exact opposite and experiment with different formats. So, enough with all the cycling, for now. It's time to try something new. Today we're climbing the Jishan Rock. We're starting from the parking lot, but don't let that fool you. Believe you me, I came here on a bicycle, cycling riverside along the Shuangxi Creek, a route you can see in an earlier video. Jishan Rock is a 52 meter hill, which would be record setting in the Netherlands. However, by Taiwan standards, it is but a pimple on the beautiful rugged surface of the island. Yet, it's full of interesting places. There is a gate, a temple, Taoist, my favorite, two different stones with different stuff carved on them, and a 300 year old camphor tree, where we're gonna pause for a while as my inquisitiveness or pedantry, if you would, got the better of me. Just give me a moment to gear up and we're ready to roll. Which way? Which way is the right way? Okay. Lots of information here to process, and I was trying to chew on it all as I walked. People say a human head is a natural gimbal. Well, maybe I'm not fully human, but mine isn't. It seems I shake my head way too much, hence all the cuts. I will improve my setup and work on the technique, but what's already been filmed will have to be endured first. Thank you for your understanding.
Now, you might be shaking your head at the way I am shaking mine, but it really doesn't feel as dizzy inside my head as it looks on the video. So here is the today's puzzle. In one place, the text has a character that makes no sense at all. It says the tree can cheat insects. What they probably meant to say was deter. Yet there isn't any word I can think of that would be similar by pronunciation. So how come? What's going on? I asked a very intelligent and knowledgeable friend of mine who's an absolute expert in Chinese. She said the character was supposed to be the similarly written chu and that's a mistake one can make when using the Zhangjie input method which is based on visual similarity between characters, specifically brush strokes, and not their pronunciation. It's good to have friends. And in other great news, the friend who helped me out here has a YouTube channel with weekly podcasts, so if you want to brush up your Chinese, check it out. The link is in the description. The tallest point has a view on the nearby hospital. You might sneer at the height we're at, but seriously, it's a great little height and much less known than the Elephant Mountain. Of course, you can't shoot Taipei 101 from here, which is too bad because we all know that building desperately needs more photos of it taken. Here I was wondering how the squirrel was gonna weasel its way out of that predicament, but it proved easy. Just jumping into it was all it took. What's not to like about being a rodent, apart from compulsive hoarding and the dental appointments? That was one nice hike. I just wish it was filmed better and probably so do you. See you in the next one.